As I look, point to the plug down there, I see my underwear. So it's going to be so like juicy. Hi my loves, welcome back to a new video. So today I'm going to be showing you how I got this really natural, like everyday look. Um, with some products that I've been really really loving um, at the moment and I really wanted to like share them with you. Some of them I've already used but I just wanted to put them all together to get this because this kind of look is so me, you know, um, especially on, a, on an everyday basis. It's just glowy and just skin-like. Also, if you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe. Today's post notification shout out is gonna go to Ashna Gujadur. So thank you so much for your really sweet comment. I really appreciate it. And if you guys wanna get one next time, all you have to do is subscribe, press the bell button, and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so. Or you can just leave a nice comment. So yeah, I'm not gonna talk on too much and we'll jump straight onto the tutorial. The first thing I'm gonna do is use my Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. And this stuff's so good, like it plumps my lips so well like i've never tried a lip product that plumps that actually plumps like that you know so just look at my lips now and look at, towards the end of the video it's uh, it's going to be so like juicy i'm then going to use my fenty skin spf moisturizer i'm going to use like four pumps a generous amount but i've been loving this stuff it smells really good it doesn't leave like a white cast or anything just put a little bit under my eyes too on my lids too I'm going to be using my soap brow for my brows today. It's still quite early, so like it's not really bright, bright outside. So guys, the other day I made Napolitan, and if you don't know what Napolitan is, it's like a traditional Mauritian sweet. And I made some the other day for the first time and they turned out pretty well. The only thing, there were a couple of things that I really wanted to perfect, and especially the biscuit, it was a bit dry. But so many of you sh kindly shared your recipes with me on Instagram. So I'm gonna be trying some um, just to make sure that I can do it properly before doing a video on it. Okay, I'm gonna leave my brows like that for now and then we can fill them in in a bit. I'm now gonna use my Laura Mercier Pure Canvas Hydrating Primer. Okay, now I'm gonna use my Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer in the shade Almond. You guys know, like, I love my NARS Tinted Moisturizer, but I've used that so many times. This, one, this one's a new discovery, and it's really, really nice. And when it comes to summertime, I love wearing Tinted Moisturizer because I sweat so much in my face. Like, I don't sweat anywhere else. I sweat on my face, especially my upper lip, you know? Give this video a like if you know what the upper lip struggles are, right? And this shade is actually pretty good. It's a little bit more on the pinky side rather than the yellow, but you know, it's only a tinted moisturizer, I don't mind. Ooh, so pretty. I don't know why, but I'm just really liking the kind of like natural daylight. Station 19 and Grey's Anatomy are two show are two shows that I just love. My, me and my sister obsessed, and we've been following the, uh, the new episodes lately, and they were so good, so good, guys. I thoroughly enjoyed it, and I can't wait for like next week's episode, which I think is actually today or tomorrow. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get so excited about shows. I'm just putting a bit more on this side. Oh my god, you know products like these for work? My go-to, just like quickly shove it on. So yeah, that's the tinted moisturizer. I'm now gonna be using my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in the shade Biscuit. Just gonna blend that with my sponge. And then another thing that I'm so looking forward to this week is I just, really enjoyed it last week is uh, a show called Koilanta. If you're French or Mauritian, you probably know what it is. I don't know if you get it in Mauritius, but it's basically a very well-known like French show. It's, I don't know what to compare it to because we don't have anything like it in the UK. You go to an island and you have to do really sporty stuff and survive and like eliminate people and it's just so good anyways i found last week's episode really good and it's so weird because like i haven't watched it in so many years just reminds me of when i used to be in my grandma's house when we used to watch it together i'm gonna put a little bit of concealer on my spots here that's all right i'm now gonna use the misguided contour stick in the shade d8 looks like that 
just gonna bend it with my sponge. When I go for more natural looks, oh my God, look at this mountain on my forehead. It's all right, it's all right. When I go for like more natural looks, I like to go for a cream bronzer and this one's like the perfect, perfect shade for me. Like literally perfect darkness. Do you know how many times I've walked out the door and I've done this like creamy bronzer look and I forget to blend out the lines on my, my jawline? It's like I naturally forget, I don't have a jawline so there's nothing to do down there. And I just walk out and I look in the mirror and I see these massive lines. Gosh, guys, let me know what are like one of your most embarrassing moments like recently, because you know, we've all had them right throughout our lifetime. But recently, oh my God, guys, we had the electrician come over. Don't judge me, because a lot of people like to judge on here, you know, just blending this nose thing. Before I go into my uh, very embarrassing story, I'm gonna use some of my NARS uh, Air Matte Blush. Oh my God, guys, I've been obsessed with this. Obviously a new discovery, but I know throughout summer i've got like four shades i'm gonna be using them like crazy because i've been one i've been obsessed with blush creamy blush especially and two these are so lush they're so good this one's in the shade rush tap this onto my cheek this shade especially i just feel like is so good for my skin tone to bring it up here and a little bit on the nose. I'm now gonna use my Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Powder in the shade Medium. So yeah, we had the electrician come over and my um, laundry basket was like by the plug. And I made sure like I cleaned my room. Like I don't like it when people come in my room and like it's messy, right? So I like clean my room and stuff. And then, um, you know, I thought my room was clean and everything. And he comes in my room and he's like, oh, where's the plug? And I'm like, oh, it's down there. And as I look, point to the plug down there, I see my underwear, like my dutty underwear. I'm not saying that it's dutty, but like it was from the laundry basket. But it's just, you know, when it's just laying awkwardly on the floor, it was just over there. And I was like, oh my God. And I pointed, it's like, instead of, it's like I pointed to it because the, the plug was right there. And it probably fell out of my laundry bag when I was cleaning up. Guys, I literally had to like pick it up in front of him. Why does this shit happen to me? And I know it doesn't happen to me only because I was talking to my friends and they went through it too, okay? Okay, I've set my under eyes. I feel like I need a bit more blush. I've also been obsessed with this uh, Nars Claudette duo. I mean, Nars are killing it, okay? With the blushes. I'm just gonna... I mean, I could have kept it like that, but I just like to layer blushes, you know? And then finally, I'm gonna be using the Charlotte Tilbury Glowgasm Beauty Light Wand. This is in the shade Goldasm. I've already used this before, but I just basically go like that, and then you can just blend it. But look at that, it's so glowy, guys. Look, that to that. Ooh. Then I'm gonna take the crayon side of my Huda Beauty double liner. I'm just gonna use an angled brush. And I got this tip from Madison Beer's tutorial with Vogue. And she kind of just, from the corner of her eye, she just flicks her eyeliner up. Cause I mean, on a daily basis, I don't really wear shadow. Like I just wear mostly um, mascara. I'm just gonna use my Lime Crime Bushy Brow Pen. And this stuff's good because it just imitates like brow hairs, digit. I mean, this one's running out. I need to get another one. Then I've been really obsessed with the Benefit Their Real Magnet Mascara. This stuff is actually really good. I know I did a review on it, but I obviously did like it in the review. But, you know, the more I wear it, the more I like how quick and easy it is to like fill my lashes up. And I can trust it, like literally no smudging or clumping or crumbles falling anything like that is so good okay mascara is done and honestly i'm not too fast about lips i'm just going to put a bit more of my um Too Faced lip injection and i'm just really happy with this look alone okay this is the final look guys i hope you enjoyed this really quick tutorial honestly this look is so me so natural and glowy it's just all skin. If you guys really like this video, please give it a thumbs up because it helps your girl out. Subscribe so you can join the family and I will see you in my next video.
Bye guys.